13 Action News Update, sponsored by Silver State Schools Credit Union. I'm Kalina Estrinovs, and right now in your 13 Action News Update, a crash involving a suspected impaired driver and a bicyclist had the intersection of Durango and Sahara closed for nearly four hours this morning. This happened just before 7 a.m. According to Metro Police, the bicyclist is in critical condition at the hospital. Officers say the bicyclist was not in a crosswalk. Henderson City leaders are threatening to fine extreme manufacturing after it hosted President Trump's campaign rally. The city says Sunday's event wasn't approved and the business could be fined $500 per violation and also have its business license suspended or revoked. Right now, gatherings of more than 50 people are off limits in Nevada. The Park MGM will become the first smoke-free casino resort when it reopens at the end of the month on September 30th. MGM Resorts made the announcement today. The company also noted that its Four Seasons Las Vegas property will reopen in about two weeks on September 25th. Park MGM is the last MGM Resort property to reopen worldwide. We've got a smoke advisory in place today, tomorrow, right on through Wednesday and Thursday. Occasional wildfire smoke will cut the visibility. Hopefully, fingers crossed, the air quality doesn't deteriorate too much. We are a bit warmer than average. 99 on this Monday afternoon could hit 101 in North Las Vegas. After midnight, we will let temperatures hang out in the mid 70s around the valley. We anticipate temperatures being oh, around 100, 101, 102 degrees Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday and Friday. Clean a round of wind by the end of the week. Friday will hopefully clear some of that smoke out and drop us to the 90s this weekend. All right, Justin, thank you so much. And that was your 13 Action News update. You can find more on our website, ktv.com and our free mobile app.